I think then it's necessary to move into the question of curfews because in Pima County, there were many curfews that were imposed. And I think that it's reflective of your guidance on governing with input from stakeholders. On November 11th, 2020, the county imposed a voluntary curfew. Can you explain your guidance to the county on that restriction? Um, Senator Hoffman, can you remind me if that was for the entire county or was that the university area? No, so this appears to be uh, for the entire county. So this was the, you had a two-tiered curfew process. You had a, a voluntary and then it progressed to a mandatory. And so right now we're only talking about the voluntary curfew. And so I would like you to discuss what your guidance to the county was on that restriction. Um, Senator Hoffman, what date was that? This would have been November of 2020. November of 20? 2020, correct. Then I will caveat for you, regardless of whether it applied to university first or countywide first, I would still like to know what your, I would still like you to explain your guidance to the county on that restriction. So, um, Senator Hoffman, I... I, I don't remember that specifics. I do remember a voluntary shelter in place recommendation that was made for an area at the university and surrounding the university that was done in conjunction with the University of Arizona. I don't, I apologize that I don't recall the specifics about this. So Dr. Cullen, um, is it common that you enact curfews or shelter in place initiatives? No. Policies? It, I, I, I guess the, the reason why I asked Dr. Cullen is because there are two in the course of your tenure as Pima County Health Director. And so it seems unbelievable, if you will, that you don't remember the two of them. Senator Hoffman, I, I definitely remember the university one, um, which was a shelter in place that lasted, I think, for seven days. That once again was defined to a very specific area that was discussed with the university. Uh, and I apologize, I, so I do Cole, not are, recall are the you, other one. Are you suggesting that you did not have any guidance on that shelter in place as you call it or curfew as everyone else calls it? I, Senator Hoffman, no, I'm not suggesting that. I'm just saying I do not recall what prompted that decision. So Dr. Cohen, you've, you've enacted or you've pushed for, you've recommended, let's call it, uh, two shelter in place or curfews, but 50% of them you don't remember? Senator Hoffman, that would be true right now, yes. Hmm. 